By now, your doctor would have explained the various testing options available to you as part of a program for colorectal cancer screening. This includes annual testing with a fecal immunochemical test, such as Ensure 1, that detects blood in your stool. Having blood in your stool may be a sign of lower gastrointestinal bleeding, which could be associated with a number of medical conditions, including colorectal cancer, iron deficiency anemia, diverticulitis, ulcerative colitis, polyps, or adenomas. Your doctor will be able to explain what the results of your test may mean and whether further tests are required. In this video, we will guide you through the steps necessary to perform the sample collection for the Ensure 1 test. Ensure 1 is a non-invasive test with sample collection performed in the privacy of your home following a single bowel movement. Unlike other fecal immunochemical tests, Ensure 1 uses a sample of water collected from the toilet bowl at the time of your bowel movement. It does not require you to collect the stool in a sling or bucket or require you to take a fecal sample. Ensure 1 is also not affected by any foods or medications, so you may continue to eat normally and take all your medications without any restrictions or alterations. Before performing the test, we recommend that you carefully review all enclosed patient information for detailed instructions, storage conditions, and other precautions. For accurate results, do not perform this test if you have bleeding hemorrhoids or piles, blood in the urine, or if blood is visible in the toilet bowl, during or within three days of menstruation, or if you have bleeding cuts or wounds on your hands. Your doctor can advise you if you have questions about these conditions. Also, do not perform the test if the test card is expired, or if the test kit components are damaged, or if the toilet uses salt water, or the water in the toilet is rusty. Now, let's look at the contents of the collection kit. The kit contains a test card, two blue brushes, two blue plastic waste bags, instructions, and a reply envelope. When you're ready for your bowel movement, bring all contents into the bathroom. Before you begin, it's important to remove any cleaners or bluing agents from your toilet. Simply remove any cleaning dispensers and flush the toilet twice. Now you're ready to collect the sample for your test. After your bowel movement, place the used toilet paper in one of the blue bags provided. Do not put the used toilet paper in the toilet bowl and do not flush the toilet. Next, on the test card, lift the flap to uncover two small white squares. Set the card aside. Using one of the long blue brushes, gently brush the surface of the stool for about five seconds. If the stool is loose, simply stir the water around the stool. Remove the brush from the water and gently shake it once to remove excess water and any loose stool. Transfer the water sample by gently dabbing the brush bristles onto one of the small white squares found under the flap on the test card for about five seconds. Remember, only a water sample is required for Ensure 1. You want to avoid putting feces on the white square. Some staining of the white square may occur, and this is normal. Put the used brush in a blue waste bag. Using the second blue brush provided, collect a second water sample from the toilet bowl by repeating the same process and gently dabbing the second small white square. Put the used brush in a blue waste bag and dispose of both bags in your regular household trash. Clearly print your name, date of birth, and date the sample was collected on the label located on the instructions for use or information form. Use the label to close and reseal the flap over your sample. Place the test card in the return envelope along with any completed forms requested by your physician. Return this envelope to the laboratory or medical professional as soon as possible, as the test must be developed no later than 14 days after your sample is collected. Congratulations! You have now completed the sample collection for the Ensure One test. The laboratory will process your test card and will advise your doctor of the results. Ensure One detects blood in your stool. There are many gastrointestinal conditions that may cause blood in your stool. This means that if the test is positive, more testing and evaluation by your doctor is necessary. This test does not replace your regular physical or rectal examination by your doctor. A negative test result means that no blood was detected. However, colorectal lesions, including some polyps and colorectal cancers, may bleed intermittently or not at all. Additionally, blood may not be uniformly distributed in or on the stool, and a test result may be negative even when blood or a lower gastrointestinal disease is present. Thank you for choosing Ensure One.